In this video I will show you how to export this procedural material I've created of a rock into Unity. So I already have the 3D model and if you don't have the 3D model in Unity you can go to File, Export and OBJ or FBX. So the first step is to go into UV editing and unwrap your model. You can see mine is already unwrapped. You can uh, select it all by pressing A and pressing U and unwrap and smart UV project. You can press this and it unwraps your model. Next step is going into shading and adding an image texture like so. Then you press new, you add your, your resolution and you give it a name, rock underscore base, because I'm doing the base colors first. I'll put this at a lower number so it goes quick for me, but you should probably do at least 2000 by 2000. The next step is going into renderer, choosing cycles. You should probably put that this at something like a 16. Now you go to the bake and you choose the fuse. Uncheck these two, it's very important, so that you don't get the lighting from the blender scene onto, projected onto the image. Then you press this, you press this, and you press bake. As you can see, the image has now been baked and you can save this into Unity. You do save as, and then you go to your Unity project. I have mine right here, Tutorial 3D. I go into Assets, and I'll just add it right here. And you should probably choose JPEG because it has a smaller size. I'll just call mine RockBase.jpg. Now you can go into Unity, and what you have to do is create a new material. I'll call this Rock Material. And then you add the rock base map and add this to the base map. Now we can drag this onto here. We now have the material in Unity. But as you can see, we're missing the normal map. There's no bumps. So what you do is go back and you uh, press, you delete this one, and you add a new one. You call this one rock underscore underscore normal for normal map. You can name it whatever you want. Then you go over to the bake settings again and you choose normal and then press bake. As you can see, we now have the normal map. So we can save this by pressing right here, image and save as, and we can do JPEG again, save image. Then we go back into Unity and we select the material and drag the normal map onto the normal map. Then you have to press the fix and as you can see, we now have the normal map onto the rock. If you have any questions, just ask in the comments. And yeah, have a good one. 